Reuters a Transasia Airways 6702.TW plane with 58 passengers and crew on board cartwheeled into a river shortly after taking off from a downtown Taipei airport on Wednesday, killing at least 19 people and leaving two dozen missing, officials said. Miraculously, 15 people survived the crash after the plane lurched between buildings, clipped an overpass with its port side wing and crashed upside down in the shallow water. Dramatic pictures taken by a motorist and posted on Twitter showed the plane cartwheeling over the motorway soon after the turboprop ADR 72-600 aircraft took off in apparently clear weather on a domestic flight for the island of Kinmen. I've never seen anything like this, a volunteer rescuer surnamed Chen said of the most recent in a series of disasters to his Asian carriers in the past 12 months. Television footage showed survivors wearing life jackets wading and swimming clear of wreckage. Others, including a young child, were taken to shore in inflatable boats. Emergency rescue officials crowded around the partially submerged fuselage of Flight GE-235, lying on its side in the river, trying to help those on board. Taiwan's civil aviation regulator raised the death toll to 19, with 15 injured and 24 missing. China said 31 of its tourists were on board. The plane missed apartment buildings by meters, though it was not clear if that was luck or whether the pilot was aiming for the river. Footage showed the vans getting to a halt on the damaged overpass after barely missing the plane's wing, with small pieces of the aircraft scattered along the road. The chief executive of Transasia, Peter Chen, bowed deeply at a televised news conference as he apologized to passengers and crew. Transasia's shares closed down 6.9% in heavy trade, its biggest percentage decline since late 2011. Chinese Premier Li Keqiang said his government had offered Taiwan any help necessary following the crash. Mayday Mayday The last communication from one of the aircraft's pilots was Mayday Mayday engine flame out according to an air traffic control recording on LiviaTC.net. The flame out occurs when the fuel supply to the engine is interrupted or when there is faulty combustion, resulting in an engine failure. Twin engine aircraft, however, are usually able to keep flying even when one engine has failed. The plane was powered by two Pratt and Whitney PW127M engines. Pratt and Whitney is part of United Technologies UDX.N. The head of Taiwan's Civil Aviation Authority, Lin Timming, said the aircraft last underwent maintenance on January 26. The pilot had 4,916 hours of flying hours under his belt and the co-pilot had 6,922 hours, he said. Taipei's downtown Songshan Airport, the smaller of the city's two airports, provides mostly domestic flights but also connections to Japan, China and South Korea. A statement from China's Taiwan Affairs Office said 31 of those on board were tourists from the southeastern city of Xiamen, which lies close to Taiwan's Kinmen Island. The crash is the latest in a string of mishaps to Asian carriers in the past 12 months. An AirAsia AIRA.KL jet bound for Singapore crashed soon after taking off from the Indonesian city of Surabaya on December 28, killing all 162 people on board. Also last year. Malaysia Airlines and ASM.KL jet disappeared and one of its sister planes was down over Ukraine with a combined loss of 537 lives. Transasia is Taiwan's third largest carrier. One of its ATR-72-500 planes crashed while trying to land at Pangu Island last July, killing 48 of the 58 passengers and crew on board. Taiwan has had a poor aviation safety record in recent years including the disintegration of a China Airlines 2610.TW747 on a flight from Taipei to Hong Kong in 2002, killing 225. In 2000, the Singapore Airlines jetliner taking off for Los Angeles during a storm hit construction equipment on the runway, killing dozens. The plane involved in Wednesday's mishap was among the first of the ADR-70-600S, the latest variant of the turboprop aircraft. That Transasia received in 2014 as part of an order of eight aircraft two years earlier. The 72-seat aircraft are mainly used to connect the capital, Taipei, with smaller cities and islands. ATR is a joint venture between Airbus Air. Pa and Linea Thermakai, a subsidiary of Italy's in Mechanica SIFI. Miles. Additional reporting by Civic Govind Dazami in Singapore and Ben Blanchard in Hong Kong, editing by Paul Tate and Nick McCarthy.